Okay, so today is going to be a little bit different video. I need to practice on my uh, workout routine. I need to practice on my uh, schedule for what to do. Uh, shadow boxing is the first thing I need to practice on to build up my arm again. So I've written down a few things, points I'm going to go by. Uh, shadow boxing, about three or four rounds, five rounds. I think about 20 minutes of shadow boxing. Uh, pull, pull ups. Sets of five standard or push ups. Uh, sit ups, uh, five sets. Sit ups, I don't really need to do sit ups. Um, it depends where I feel more sore. It's like a little bit sore in the arm of the winter, so. Push-ups will help. Uh, if I could do a uh, five push-ups out of twenty uh, for the week, I think that'll be okay. Planks, um, side planks. I'm not sure what that is. Three sets uh, till failure. Uh, that, that's on one arm on the side, and you're doing push-ups on the, with one arm. I think that's it. From notes that I read, uh, I took. Things from one note, things from another note, put into my own routine uh, for a prison workout. So, a couple things I don't know what they are, but I go by the little picture or by description of a prison workout. But, um, push ups again, uh, punches, the same as punches as shadow boxing, 10 punches, uh, shadow boxing, I think it's like. Shadow boxing, probably my favorite one I want to do more often. Strengthen on this arm more. Um, this arm is good, so I could do shadow boxing easier. This arm, this arm is a little bit. Uh, I might buy gloves as well for just for shadow boxing. Uh, then your sit ups, if I could do one or two sit ups out of 20, um, that's going to be okay. Uh, Punches and then your push ups, uh, jumping jacks. I probably won't do jumping jacks, uh, not because I'm on the upper floor, so maybe if I go outside, I could do jumping jacks. Uh, uh, and that's going to be the whole routine. Uh, maybe if I'm missing something here from a prison workout, you can let me know uh, what they would do in prison. Uh, so it's something I'm learning as well. Um, but if I could do a few things off the list per week, um, shadow boxing would be more, maybe a couple push-ups. Uh, so I will probably look to buy some gloves, and that'll be the workout routine. Shadow boxing is kind of what I'm interested in at the moment, um, and the push-ups, uh, sit-ups I could probably do if I. I don't have a problem with my feet. When I was in high school, I did a lot of running. That was my thing in high school. I did running. Um, so sometimes I would go on the track running uh, or just come home. I would run home. And that was the what I did in high school. I, I did mostly running uh, to keep in shape. Uh, so I could do maybe a little bit of that. But older age, uh, yeah, running is kind of hard. Uh, but if I could get back into a workout routine, uh, sit-ups, uh, I'm not be able to do many sit-ups because I've got the big belly, uh, so you might do a few steps here and there, but push-ups, if I could do some push-ups, uh, just standard push-ups, then, and the punches, uh, so I might need to buy some kind of gloves, um, this arm is getting better, but still a bit sore. So I could work that out to where it's back to normal. Uh, got swollen over the winter and it's a really bad uh, cold weather. So I need to keep things uh, bundled up till it's uh, healed up. So that's why I need to come up with a routine. And I was looking at prison style workout. I cannot do the whole set, but. If I could do a couple things out of the set, I, I would be okay uh, for the week. 
uh, to get things back in shape, uh, maybe do some running or something uh, on this side, uh, jumping jacks, um, upper floors, so, um, you can't punch a hole in the ceiling, so uh, you could do that outside or in the garage, uh, jumping jacks, you know, um, and that's going to be based uh, without doing any power lifting. Uh, would have to go to a gym probably, uh, but you have to register to a gym or something and pay monthly or something like that. So this is a basic free, uh, you can do something at home if you feel things are getting kind of sore and stiff over the winter and you need to loosen things up. Um, so that's why I have to come up with some kind of plan for a basic workout. So I'm hoping this is a level one start. If I could do uh, at least one or two um, from that, uh, I don't need to do the whole set of push-up reps, the 30 reps, but if I could do like, two push-ups, uh, that would be a good start. So uh, to have a basic plan written down. If I'm missing something that should be on there, that they would do in the prison system, you can let me know. Uh, certain rep that I might be missing. Uh, for the arms or for the legs, uh, besides sit-ups and push-ups, um, some sort of other workout like I haven't come across that they do a lot in prison that I should know, you can let me know. Otherwise, that's my basic workout for the month, for the week, for the month, uh, to get things uh, back in shape. Uh, if I feel I'm uh, getting uh, better, then uh, I need to... Um, keep the workout. Things uh, maybe could improve, uh, do more. But if I get to do one or two, I should be okay on that. But that's all I wanted to talk about today, uh, trying to build up a workout routine uh, based on the uh, prison system, and that's what I came up with. So uh, the shadow boxing and the boxing is almost the same thing, the punches, sit-ups and push-ups, and a few things that are a little bit different, planks, side planks, I don't really know what that one is, uh, three sets till failure, but um, I had to look that one up, so I wrote down a few things uh, I think I could do. Thanks for watching. This is my little plan for my workout for level one. Uh, that's it.